FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Bowser Chapman here for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update on this Tuesday, the 23rd of July. We're looking at the Dow. Uh, where did it go? Go to the Dow right now. The Dow is down 43. That's very interesting because it's just kind of stalling out a spectacular move, going to an all-time high with a round number, 41,376.00, right at the top. It's amazing how that invariably pulls, leads to a pullback. In this case, a pullback at 38,000 down in May. It was the start of a big move to the upside. Let's go to the S&P. The S&P is up quite nicely. It's up uh, four. It was up more earlier on. But it's uh, the nine period moving average is over the 40, and so it's still good. It had an all time high of 56.69.67 uh, six sessions ago, and it's just kind of taking a breather. The, the QQQ, that's a little different. QQQ right now is uh, down 34 cents. It's kind of stalling in a spectacular move. It's got semiconductors, it's got a lot of things in it that just says, you know, I need a bit of a break. I've had a great run. I just need uh, some kind of a. Uh, a, a reinvigoration. <laughs> we'll see if that happens. IWM has taken the lead. It is up a dollar seventy-one. A uh, very nice move to the two 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 area, and it needs to go to two two six point six five to really extend this leg in the weekly chart. Uh, that's going to be a big F. But the monthly chart has really improved a lot for the small caps. This is a Russell. Uh, I, this is a Russell two thousand. Looking at the, um, uh, let me go to gold right now. Gold is down. Oops, is down from the high, but it's still up eleven points. Oh no, actually, it's doing very well. It's near the high of the day, which was 2413, but it's just kind of stuck in a sideways digestive phase. The dollar has taken the lead. Isn't that interesting? It is up a little bit. It's up 19 ticks at 104.40. It doesn't look great, but it is in the lower range trying to bounce. But here's the most important thing. I never did it in my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour earlier. Um, I forgot. I did it in the update, but at 119 and 430 seconds, the yields are still in the higher range. They really need to come down quite a bit more to help. And the crude oil, the other guy, crude oil is down a dollar 39. Very sharp move. I said it's going to the 200 period moving average of 76.79. Uh, we'll see if that happens. And the other thing is, I'm doing my webinar at four o'clock today for subscribers to my opening call. Check out the front page with all these fabulous Tiger Dollar Sale. You've got, you, you can almost get it for free because if you don't like it, you can just dump it at the end of the month. Uh, but it means after uh, three, four weeks. But this gives you, uh, you can go to my webinars, you can get my daily newsletter, you can go to the webinars often and get the advice that I'm looking at, the stocks that we're going to be looking at, and ETFs could be good. Have a great day.